Prince Andrew's dark plot exposed as he lobbied hard to block King Charles from the throne. It was obvious that the relationship between the Duke of York and former Prince of Wales is reported to have broken down in recent years. In fact, the Duke of York allegedly lobbied very hard to try and stop King Charles III from becoming the monarch after the Queen died. An explosive new book delving into the life of Camilla, Queen Consort, by royal biographer Angela Levin, alleges that Prince Andrew tried to convince his late mother to make Prince William king instead. Andrew attempted to block Charles marrying Camilla because he rarely got on well with his eldest brother. Angela Levin reports that, according to a senior insider, Queen Elizabeth had sought Prince Andrew's advice about Charles marrying Camilla, his former mistress whom he began publicly dating in 1999. Andrew tried to persuade the Queen to block Charles from marrying Camilla by being quite poisonous, mean, unhelpful, and very nasty about Camilla, the person said. He argued that Camilla was insufficiently aristocratic and untrustworthy. Miss Levin made further claims as Andrew wanted his nephew to have the crown before he was 18 so he could take the position as regent. He's also said to have tried to turn Queen Elizabeth against his brother's partner and appeared very angry that he couldn't rule the country in some way. Andrew lobbied very hard with the hope that Charles would not become king when his mother passed and that William would wear the crown. At the time, William was only a teenager. They were dark and strange times where paranoia became reality and this was a worry. When his mother didn't see to Andrew's request, he reportedly turned against her, Levin's source claimed. His behavior was very, very negative and extremely unpleasant to Queen Elizabeth, who disagreed. I was told it was one of the rare occasions he didn't get his way. Nonetheless, he was apparently very angry that he couldn't rule the country in some way. He remained so hostile to Camilla's emergence and acceptance that it's doubtful it has ever been forgiven. Prince Andrew and King Charles III walked together during their mother's recent funeral, putting their disagreements and lifelong differences to one side. As his siblings, the King, Princess Royal, and Earl of Wessex wear military uniform, the Duke of York will be in civvies. The death of Queen Elizabeth II marked the beginning of Charles' reign and a new era of royalty. Nevertheless, it is proof, if it were needed, that nothing much will probably change for Andrew now that his brother Charles is king. He remains stripped of his military patronages and use of his royal highness title. As the queen's son, he has adopted a visible role thanking well-wishers at Balmoral Castle. It would be out of the question for him not to be involved, especially as the royal family has been keen to present a united front at this time. But as for any public role thereafter, it seems likely he will remain excluded. Plus, now that Prince Charles has leveled up and morphed into King Charles, there are a ton of changes in the royal family, including where everyone is going to live. Charles himself is moving to Buckingham Palace and apparently has a bunch of plans for other royal properties, including, potentially, the Royal Lodge, where his disgraced brother Prince Andrew lives with his ex-wife Sarah Ferguson. As part of his new role as king, it is thought Charles will look into the crown's vast property portfolio and make some changes. This could lead to Andrew being kicked out of the Royal Lodge, a mansion he has shared with Sarah for years. Although Andrew is safe for the moment, he could be asked to leave at some point in the future. Asked about the rumors of the Royal Lodge's future, a spokesperson for Prince Andrew declined to comment. While Andrew settled the case in the U.S. without accepting guilt, he was stripped of his royal and military titles and has been forced away from the spotlight at the behest of King Charles III and his son, Prince William.